It's June 30th, last day of June, last day of June Dairy Month. And once again, we're going to celebrate with ice cream. For this segment, we headed to IceCreamSource.com up in Door County to sample some of the hottest new frozen treats. Looks like just an ordinary brown box, but imagine getting this delivered to your door with ice cream inside. This is what they do at IceCreamSource.com. We're up here in Sister Bay in Door County. This is Brad Massey, and this is what you do. Exactly. You mail ice cream around the country? Uh, anywhere in the continental U.S. And what kinds of ice cream are you mailing to people, sending to people as gifts? We are sending the hard-to-find, super-premium ice creams uh, that are made by small to medium-sized uh, dairies. Um, so not ones that I'm going to find in my grocery store? Most, most likely not. What you will find in their cooler, Massey describes as the best of the best, yeah. all available in one place, like Silver Moon. Silver Moon is, uh, is a liqueur-infused ice cream. Uh, super, super premium. Should I be off the clock right now, or am I going to be uh, okay? You'll be okay with just a taste. With flavors like pomegranate martini and bourbon vanilla bean, it might be a big hit at your next party. Mmm. I love it, and there's no calories. Kidding. Mmm, that was good. What else do you well, have? Why don't we try the Chow Bella Key Lime Graham Cracker? Ooh. This is going to taste a whole lot like a key lime pie. Massey describes the Italian gelato as a little lighter than American ice cream. For fat-free and all-natural goodness, he recommends Blood Orange by GS Gelato and Sorbet. Ooh, now, just see, look at it's look just, at the it's, color. It's like fluffier as, than than most sorbets that you see. It's like a super rich orange, but oh. there's something else going on, you know? I love it. The folks at IceCreamSource.com say their biggest sellers continue to be chocolate and vanilla. But you haven't tasted chocolate or vanilla like this. It's Choctaw and features robust chocolate flavors from around the world. It's kind of like what Starbucks did for coffee 20 years ago. I mean, we were all drinking Folgers and we thought, oh, wow, this stuff, you know, this Starbucks stuff is so, so strong. Who will ever actually get into this? And that's what they're trying to do for ice cream. And if you're worried about ordering ice cream during the hot summer months, don't be. Everything we ship is shipped with dry ice, and dry ice is 109 degrees below zero, and we could ship it to the hottest area of the country, and there's, it'll stay very, very cold. Okay, it was all so good, but before you dive in there, let me just say, the one I want you to try is called Clemmy's. It's an all-natural, sugar-free ice cream that they say is their number one seller right now. Really? It's the most popular, I think because it says it's sugar-free, it's actually a sugar substitute. Okay. I believe it's co it comes from California. Give it a try. This is the coffee flavor. I know you like coffee. Oh, yeah, it's, it's good. It's made with xylitol. Mm. I, I thought there was a little bit of xylitol taste in there. <laughs> No, it's so it's good. not calorie-free, calorie-free, but yeah. it is lower in calories. What good. do you think? Good. Now this is the Choctaw. Is the one he described as like, you know, you're a coffee lover. You like it dark and robust, right? Right. right. Okay. See what so you this think. This is chocolatey, chocolatey, chalk, right? Chocolatey, right? chocolatey, yeah. chalk, chalk. Calamantan, Calamantan chocolate ice cream. It's really, it's good, but. It might be an acquired taste like coffee. A little bit of a different taste, but it's good. I thought it was very dark, like, but I like a dark chocolate. Mm. Anyway, if you would like these or other the other awesome ice creams, I tried IceCreamSource.com, and they're located right up in Door County. Okay. You can't go to Door County to get the ice cream, so you have to order online.